All right, we're ready. Weston Pass, I've never run here, and I've probably driven by this a thousand times in my life because it's on the way to my hometown, BV. And uh, it's a beautiful day. A little warm, but that's okay. Uh, gonna do my watch. I am currently at 9,938 feet. So, basically 100% of this run will be over 10,000 feet. I think I'm gonna top out at about 12,000, and it's gonna be a long one. Starting to practice the old forever pace. And because uh, this is basically the first pretty long run for prep for the 100 miler in September, which believe it or not is about two and a half months away. So you got to start now. And uh, I'm excited. I got my cliff shots, I got my goose, I got my baby food, I got my water. Probably the most important thing today is water because it's it is warm uh, and windy, as you can hear in the microphone right now. Gotta get rid of my gum. Hold on. Gotta have a couple of these to start. Mm, yeah. Tip of the day, whenever you're going out for a long run, out in the wilderness, make sure you tell someone where you're going. Just like, that's a tip of the day, something True Love and I do. So, she knows where I'm at, and, uh, you know, just you just got to put that out there. Come on. Seven point eight three miles to the top, eleven thousand nine hundred twenty-one feet. So, about two thousand feet of vertical, <laughs> vertical. And I'm gonna tack on a couple miles up here. Gonna hit that marathon distance today. Woo! That was a doozy. Uh, you basically gain most of the elevation in the last three miles. So yeah, that was a doozy. Little background there. All right, let's go. Live to see another day. Live to see another day. I'm now standing in Fair Play, Colorado. Um, got 23.7 miles in. I wanted that 26 miles so bad, the marathon distance, but I don't mess around with lightning. And, oh man, I was gunning for it. I was feeling good, cruising, but I don't mess around with lightning. God bless the couple from Kansas City in their Jeep that stopped to pick me up because I was thumbing. That's right, I did some hitchhiking back to my car the last two miles because there was lightning striking. Not too close, but close enough that I was like, this just isn't worth it. This is not worth it. Live to see another day, live to fight another day. There's many more days of running ahead if you're smart, if you're smart. So that's what I did, I called it. And um, I literally said, Lord, please send me a car. Cause it was getting a little, okay, it was getting a little testy, a little testy, but I was just hanging out in the trees, you know, squatting down, just make, being safe. And I was like, Lord, send me a car. Boom, 10 seconds later, boom, here comes the Jeep. So, all right, I uh, just soaked my legs in the creek. Tomorrow, I'm gonna try and go long again and far again and high again and elevation and vert and all that good stuff over in Breckenridge. That's where I'm driving to right now. But because I'm going to do that, i got to soak my legs in this icy cold water and uh, see if I can recover a little bit. P.S. True love, thank you for the snack, the sandwich, and the spicy Cheetos. The spicy, the, come on. Great post-run snack, huh? huh? Folks, this is real life. I'm in a car, Toyota Corolla, going to bed. I'm not camping out in a tent tonight. Uh, decided to go with a car. I don't own a small tent. We have the 10-man tent for the family. 
and uh, which is great for the family. But I don't know, maybe someday I'll get a small tent. I just don't really, I don't know. It's car works, car works, you know. I, I basically aspire to be like my brother, Joseph, who has a nice truck. And he, I think he's got like a nice setup in the back where he can sleep. And I would like that at some point. I would like that at some point. But for now, the Toyota Corolla is going to have to do. So uh, that was a great excursion. I'm in Breckenridge, Colorado, just so you know. And tomorrow, running up and down Breckenridge in the morning. Well, first, Starbucks, work, then running up and down, and then zipping back to Denver, more work. So that's a drill. All right, that's all. Signing off. I was going to say something creative and interesting, but I forgot. I don't know. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.